Okay, so we did a video yesterday covering the Shannon Sharp viral video. I had highlighted the video that went viral, Shannon Sharp getting out his SUV. And then I also highlighted Chad Ochocinco Johnson reaction to that. We highlighted his response on my YouTube channel yesterday. I did a video covering that. I'll have the link to that down below in the description box or in the pinned comment if you guys want to go check that video out. But in today's video, I want to highlight Kwame Brown and Jason Whitlock's reaction because I feel like highlighting their reactions is going to be good for engagement because I feel like a lot of people is going to either agree or disagree with Kwame Brown and Jason Whitlock. So I just wanted to highlight that in today's video. So with that being said, let's get right into today's video. Let's highlight Kwame Brown's comment first. And then after that, I got Jason Whitlock coming up next, man. So with that being said, guys, hit that like button if you support my YouTube channel. I really do appreciate that. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button as well. That really does help support my YouTube channel. Let's check out what Kwame Brown had to say. Here's a video. Club Shay Shay. <laughs> Club Gay Gay. <laughs> that wasn't me now. That's what old boy said. Club Shay Shay. First of all, I don't know what's wrong with your leg. But you might be bow leg and pigeon toe. I don't know. And they, some people say you had a football injury. So if that's the case, then we understand why you're standing like that. But some of this other stuff I don't get, my brother. Like, you putting your hands up like that? Yeah, I don't understand it. Your pants being that tight. But it's your pants. Your shirt being that tight. And that damn, wait a minute, is that a Hermes bag? And the cameraman ain't do you no help either because he right behind you. Ooh, the way you close that door. Yes. <laughs> no, come on now. Wait a minute now. This, this man wearing a Hermes bag. This is a purse. Oh, hell no. The two locks right there gave it away. Look at the locks. Bam. This man wearing that Hermes bag. Come on, dog. Okay, that's what Kwame Brown had to say about Shannon Sharp. I'll have his full video linked down below if you guys want to go check out full version of that. I'll have the link to that down below in the description box. So let's get right into what Jason Whitlock had to say about it because I don't want to hold you guys too long in today's video. Let's check out what Jason Whitlock had to say. Bottom line is uh, the zesty rumors about Shannon Sharp are getting wider and wider and more pervasive. And he, Shannon Sharp has been upset with Mike Epps and Eddie Griffin and uh, comedians that have been going at him ever since the Cat Williams interview. And, and it's starting to spread like wildfire. And, and so Shannon Sharp built an entire persona built around pleasing black Twitter. And now black Twitter is coming for Shannon Sharp. And, and I just don't think Shannon has thought this through. I, I don't, th this entire uh, movement that athletes are, are in, and again, their handlers and the puppet masters, all this whole fashion thing that men, and particularly black men, have been, this lane they've been put in. How, how far can you push the envelope? in terms of fashion? How sexually fluid in terms of fashion can you be? And so Shannon Sharp loves to wear the tightest clothes he can possibly wear at all times. He now has committed to carrying a purse or a bag or whatever. And it's, it's no different. Remember, I used to get on uh, Cam Newton, and this is why Cam Newton is upset with me, but I was right. I was just trying to give Cam great advice. Remember when Cam used to wear the bonnet around his head at press conferences and all that, and I'm just like, what are you doing, man? You're trying to be a leader of men. This is going to blow up in your face. But there's been all of this messaging for black men that there's great wealth, great celebrity and fame, great support if you make your persona more sexually fluid. And these guys are going for it. Okay, that's what Jason Whitlock had to say about it. You can either agree or disagree with what Jason Whitlock is saying, right? And if you disagree, you can definitely get in the comment section down below and give your opinion on the reason why you disagree with Jason Whitlock. I didn't watch Jason Whitlock's full video, but based off of the clip that I just highlighted, it just opens the door up to have a conversation about 
How do you feel about today's entertainers and their fashion choice of preference in today's time? Because if you think about fashion from the early 2000s versus now, clothes were baggy back then. And the fashion choices back then, it wasn't considered feminine. But now in today's time, a lot of the fashion choices, a lot of people now consider the fashion choices by men to be more feminine in today's time. So yeah, like I was saying with Jason Woodlock and how he had presented his video based off of the clip that I just saw, you can have a conversation about that, whether if you agree or disagree with Jason Woodlock's point about Shannon Sharp. So yeah, that's it for today's video, guys. I just want to highlight their reactions. Y'all get in the comment section down below. How do y'all feel about today's video? Be sure to hit that like button if you made this part in the video. Don't forget to subscribe up as well if you're new to the channel. Catch you guys on the next video and we out, guys. Peace.